Welcome to Seals on the Move. I'm Alex Seals, and Rosie Seals is along for the ride. Although I was told in the 90s that I shouldn't go chasing waterfalls, I disregarded the advice and came to Burgess Falls State Park in Sparta, Tennessee, where there are three waterfalls that I saw, each more massive than the one before. The river was used as a power generator for Cookville, Tennessee, from the late 20s to mid 40s. There's also a butterfly garden in the parking lot, so let's get a move on with Seals on the Move. This is a really nice state park and you can hear the waterfall in the distance and I am excited about that. Big old waterfall. You gotta beware of the bats right here. It's got a bat house. I don't think we'll see any during the day. And here comes the rosy. So are you excited, Rosie? We're gonna go see a good waterfall. Yeah, you can hear it. It sounds really good. Yeah, Rosie didn't get to go to the big waterfall with her parents in Zimbabwe. Uh, what is it called, Victoria Falls? And that's like the biggest waterfall in the world, I think. Yeah, I think it is. Bigger than Niagara. Now you get to see a little baby version. Looky here, the waterfall wrote a sign. It says, welcome to my home. Or maybe it's the, the whole state natural area wrote the sign, not just the waterfall. I guess waterfalls don't have hands. Oh, look at there. Oh, cool. You can get your passport stamped. It's backwards, it says May 7th, 2021. So it's not even the right day. I guess you have to switch it. Huh, neat. Let me get back there. Have a nap. Oh, look at here. Got park. All right, so that's the waterfall we're going to see. And some info. And if we can get that open, got a map there too. Pretty neat. Look over there! <laughs> Front kind of looks like a heart. You know, if you squint. taking a selfie. So it says it's a strenuous trail and you can see these tree branches everywhere, there's rocks. But it doesn't seem like it'll be that bad. No, I think just because it's very slippery because of the rocks. Hey, well, yes. that, that rock back there was a bit slippery. Look, you can follow the moss growing on the tree that grows on what, the north side, I think? You don't know? <laughs> I learned that from a, uh, a Sonic the Hedgehog cartoon, actually. Oh, all right. Ooh, covered in trees, but still pretty. 
put some steel cable overhead. Woo, just went down a, a drop there. Ooh, I think we've already made it to the overload. Oh, wow, that's nice. Is this like a bridge at some point? Ooh, bird. Wow, what is this? Let's see, does it say? Oh, there you go. Huh. So it carried a pipe. A plume. Oh, there's another one. There's another overlook. That's probably even better. And now we go into the creepy tunnel. Here comes Rosie. So apparently these aren't the big falls. There's another spot we need to go to for that. It's not very strenuous when they actually add steps. And I like how you're next to the river the whole time. It's nice. A lot of hiking paths where you never, you know, you just see water occasionally. Now there's another one in this area and it will, you actually cross the river multiple times. So you get wet. Here there's no swimming. Ooh, massive tree fall over. Ooh, what's that? Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Little mini waterfalls. Baby waterfalls, if you will. And that's cool up there. We'll go up there and get... It did. Yeah. It's probably about 60 degrees out here. Which is pretty nice. Ooh, that's nice. This looks like it was lightning, doesn't it? Yeah, but it also looks like it was feisted. I can hear the other waterfall, unless that's the rapids. Look, that's another waterfall. You can see the Ooh, it's a bunch of tree branches. 
Ooh. Ooh. Wow, that's pretty right there. And now, we've got the edge of a waterfall over here. Should be able to see it better up these stairs. You can get a glimpse of it through those trees right there. Well, maybe not on the video. These are a lot of stairs. Think they'll install an escalator out here, Rosie? No, I can't. <laughs> We're getting close. There's a block overlook right here. Can't see it very well at all. But I can see Rosie pretty well. At the overlook. Ooh, wow, look at the rock down there. Got a bench to sit at. Ooh. Look at that down there. Looks like we're not at the final overlook though. There is, let's say there's another Burgess Falls overlook. You know what be really fun? You can push this log off the cliff and watch it fall. But I think that would be illegal to do. Is there another overlook? Looks like this was added later. Hmm. Take a look at this cool tree. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I like how the roots are all above ground. Yeah. Ooh, it looks like a face. There's a tree back there that looks like it's trying to sit down. Well, it needs pyro work, look at it. Yeah, it's a good adjustment issues. there. It might have a straight back again. I'm glad we kept walking, because there is something here. Let's... Huh. No water access at Topper Falls. Huh. Oh, wow. Now these are the real thing. Whoa. I don't think the other one we were at were the real falls. This is definitely the real deal. Some of God's creation at its best. greenery behind that uh, waterfall right over there, a little mini one. You can see the mist down there. The mist coming off the uh, waterfall.
flights of stairs. Oh wow. You used to be able to go down to the bottom. Can't do that anymore. So close it off. Um, there was a there was some kind of flood or something here, but now you can't go down there. Oh, but look. Not something you expect to see when you're not at the beach. Yeah. Oh, they all, they made it right all the way through. Oh, yeah. Well, there's actually little oysters, like, Hi. I guess, clams, yeah. That's crazy. flower here. Should we send it down the waterfall, Rosie? Should we send him down the waterfall? Yeah, why not? Be free, little flower. There he goes. waterfalls.
Now here's a tree you could set up a big slingshot in. Look at that thing. Just strap a massive rubber band across it. You can start launching stuff across the uh, waterfall over there to the other side. There you go. It's a natural slingshot. Ooh, that's a really cool flower. So this is the butterfly garden right in here. Really pretty place, just out here in the state park. Apparently you can see all kinds of bugs here, but they even have the plants cataloged. So you know what plant you're looking at. And I guess these are plants that are specifically designed to attract butterflies and other bugs of the sort. I like these purple ones right here. We got a nice bridge over there. Well, it might be a little too cool for the bugs right now. As I would say, what, do you think it's about 60-something degrees out here? Like yeah, but it's here at the uh, Burgess Falls State Park, along with the waterfalls. So if you come on a warmer time, <laughs> you can probably see some though. bugs. It's oh, it's great for hiking, yes. But just not for... Not too sticky not and hot for, and for butterfly viewing. I don't see one. And I saw online that people saw a bunch of different kinds of bugs. Not really butterflies per se, but a bunch of different kinds of bugs. I love the purple ones. Looks like it might be a cocoon or a chrysalis. Not sure. This is curious as know what that is. Look, it's got tracks. Yeah. It smells like phloem out here. That that Nickelodeon stuff that you could mold and play with back in the nineties. Phloem. You don't like the smell of phloem, obviously. We hope you enjoyed this episode. What is the most beautiful waterfall you have ever seen? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, hike on over to the subscribe button, share this with your hiking friends, subscribe to stay up to date with adventures, and hit the bell icon to be notified of future adventures. If you would like to support us, our Patreon link is in the description below. Even a dollar helps. As always, thanks for watching and supporting.